you guys are going to be given a poem. I'm putting you into pairs, and you are going to work on your poem, reading it fluently. You're going to read it to your partner three times. They're going to read it back to you three times, and then you're going to decide how you want to read it to the class. You could read it where it's one person reads one line and the next person reads the other. You could read it where you both read it together. You could read it, these things are called stanzas. You could read it where one person reads one stanza, one person reads the next. You get to decide. The part that really matters is that every time you read it, look, the first time you read something, you don't know how it's going to sound. Truman, stop spinning, please. So you're just going to try your best, and then when you're buddy reading with your friend, they'll help you with the words. I'll walk around and help you with the words. But we want it to sound like we're excited, that we look at what's in our poem, and it helps us understand what to do next. The only other thing is, you guys are going to be given this checklist to help you help your friends. So your friend will help you and says, I read smoothly, I don't stop after every word. Now the first time through, you might do that. Even the second time, that's okay. If a word or sentence doesn't sound right, I read it again. That's what we do in guided reading all the time. My reading sounds natural, like I'm talking to a friend. That's your goal by the end. Is it going to be like that the first time you read it? No, maybe not. Um, I group words into meaningful phrases, so like we did with really, really, really got to go, it didn't make sense to just break it apart. I read with expression. That's when we get excited or we get sad. I pay attention to punctuation. We were all just doing this. We looked at commas and periods. We put our voices up at a question and we bring them down. And you understand what you're reading. Evelyn, stop spinning, please. Okay, so everybody's going to get one of these. I will pass out our, um, our poems. And then for the next 15 minutes before the field trip, that's what you're going to work on. Wesley, you can pause it. Thank you.